back to Pub Draw, everyone. Hey. This is a draw along show where I, Marisha Ray, the student, learn how to draw with our wonderful teacher, Babs Draw. Babs Tar. <laughs> <laughs> At Babs Draws <laughs> on Twitter. So smooth it's, so um, far. Yeah. It's been a week. It's been a week. <laughs> Today we have a special guest. Someone else who's also had a week. Travis Willingham. Hi, Marisha. Thanks for having me. Hi, how are you? Wonderful. Uh, you're a little you're a little sleeper success. You're a little ringer, Who, aren't me? you? What? Yeah. Yeah, this guy over here. This guy. <laughs> secret talents that he hasn't been telling anybody. Really good at massages, <laughs> uh, finger traps. I can always get people out. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, yeah, sure. Yeah, Those, yeah. Yeah. Um, as you know, this season, Babs is teaching us how to draw the basics of drawing. And the goal for all of us is to be able to draw a unique D&D character by the end of this season. And the lesson for today is more body basics with Grog. Yeah, yeah. get the body basics, get the body basics. <laughs> <laughs> Never skip leg day in the gym <laughs> or on the tablet. Or you can skip them and just draw those quads in later. Yeah. <laughs> a little bit of bronzer, a little bit of fake tan. Ooh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Nothing is real. Um, <laughs> before we get into today's lesson, a reminder that this episode of Pub Draw is brought to you by Wacom. Wacom is offering a special limited time deal for the Pub Draw audience. We've only done this once before. With your purchase of a Cintiq 16, Wacom will also include an adjustable stand, like the ones we use on the show, for free in $80 value. Mm. That's pretty awesome. Really? All you have to do is head to the US Wacom store, add both items to your cart, and then put in the promotional code in the billing information section, where you put in like, your credit card and stuff. Uh, this offer is only for the Pub Draw audience and is limited for the first 48 hours from the release of both this show and on YouTube as well. You can look in the chat right now or throughout the show in the chat box thingy or like the description box on YouTube for the code um, and a lot of the information on how you can capitalize on this awesome offer. As always, thank you, Wacom, for your support. Thank okay. you, Wacom. Last week, we told you how to submit your drawings for a chance to win an Intuos Pro. Our winner this week is Megan Tohill. Megan Megaloo on Megan Twitter. Megaloo. Let's look at Megaloo. that. Let's look at that. Ooh, look at that bot. But there should wow. be a few, so um, keep going. That's nice. Oh, oh, oh there's it. Wow. So Marisha did some poses last week, so we did some life drawing and some like body basics where everything lines up. Do you guys have the final one? What? Wow. I yeah. thought she did such a good job with the costume. It looked really lovely. She did a good job with the hands. The hands look really natural. Mm -hmm. She did a great job. I appreciate Dang. those hands. I love it. Great That's job. so impressive, what Megan. What in the time. Props. Mm -hmm. Good job, Megan. Yeah. Uh, stay tuned because later in the episode we will be doing a giveaway in chat of a Welcome Into Us, and we will be telling you how to submit your drawings for a chance to win your very own Cintiq 16, <laughs> which is what I'm drawing on today for the second time. <laughs> uh, other than your homework. Other than my homework, which I've been doing at home. Um, it's it feels like my my first Cintiq. It's very nice. Um, my okay. First Cintiq. <laughs> yes, the baby's first Cintiq. Mm -hmm. Let's draw. Let's draw. Let's draw. All right. Um, let's do my screen for a second because we're gonna do a few things today. Are there artist warm ups like? Wow, wow, you can wow, do some wow, circles. Wow, do that. That's uh, you know we do some warm up circles to kind of loosen you up, but. Okay. I don't know if you need it, cause I mean, look at this. What? Um, let's Travis show Travis's camera real quick. <laughs> I just no, that was just. I just oh, you know when you I've get the never, crayons at like the restaurant. Is this good? I don't know. Yeah, you get the crayons in the <laughs> restaurant, and you just like. Look what this guy did uh -huh. earlier today when we were chilling. Using we Yugi, using edit? Hugo's art for reference. Yeah, a little so Hugo good. Love. That's right. crazy. Okay. All right. So try, I have high expectations from you oh, today, shit. Travis. Yeah, Middle you messed arc. up. Okay. You shouldn't have done it. <laughs> shouldn't, shouldn't have done it. Shouldn't have done it. <laughs> um, okay, so today we're gonna do, I kinda wanna do a grog portrait because he's so cute. 
and <laughs> I thought maybe we could do a grog portrait and then the last 30 minutes we'll kind of go over like a grog body real quick. Um, so yeah, so I've got him um, drawn out here with some reference pictures that I made our producers oh, buy me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> the man himself. Thanks, Vinny. Yeah, yeah it's so beefy. <laughs> And Travis knows all the names of these muscles, yep. and I do not know them. You so, don't? No, I just know how to draw them, so you will have to point oh, them yeah. out. The ham so we know all the names. and then you got the loin cut, <laughs> right? and you got your short rib, Yep, yep. and then you got your dingle banger, <laughs> and we'll, we'll get to them, don't worry. Technical, we're yeah. technical yeah. terms. The dingle banger is the one that always gets your juices flowing, right? Dingle banger. <laughs> Why? Why? Just keep saying it, this please. Show. Dingle banger. <laughs> um, so yes, but, and then but I think let's start out with um, a cute grog portrait. So we've been doing these Loomis heads, Travis. Mm -hmm. um, Andrew Loomis is this amazing illustrator, and he does. He has this head outline. Um, that kind of like shows you all these landmarks. So I'm gonna do it real quick to review with everybody. So you start with a circle, or we'll do it over top of your head. This will be even better, actually. She's a wizard with this thing. <laughs> Seriously, you could pilot a starship. It's like I know. I've been doing it for a very long time. I'm pretty sure Photoshop also makes okay. starship pilot uh, software as well, so. So you start with a circle, and then um, you do a little one that represents the side of your head. Okay. And it should fall along your eyebrow here. You can doodle this along if you okay. want, or you could just watch. Um, we're reviewing for everybody else. And then this top of the circle is your hairline. And then the middle of your circle is your eye line. And then the bottom of this is your nose. Okay. And then you kind of measure, ooh, I did that a little fun. Well, can we, help you know, out, can we help out Daddy Willingham's hairline and lower um, it five inches? <laughs> no? Okay. Let's do it. No, no, let's, 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 be, let's just be real. It's fun. It's fun. <laughs> I was going to say, um, so that Loomis head is a, a default, um, and everybody's head shapes are a little bit different. Yeah. Um, and Travis has a little bit of a bigger forehead. Don't be polite. Call it a satellite. It's cool. It's got a fucking gravitational pull. You can say it. It's a little bit uh. bigger than that. What we learned before, so. A little bigger. This is better. I like the polite approach. <laughs> She's already so, so nice. Yeah, yeah. yeah, you can pick this shit out in the crowd because you're like, nim, nim, so, nim. <laughs> so, that measuring thing where we would do one, two, and three might not work, but um, we'll just do, we'll keep guesstimate somewhere in the middle. I love how you keep, keep like, traveling over the real estate of my forehead <laughs> yeah. like it's a barren it's wasteland. It's like a really, yeah. really long face, the whole thing. <laughs> Why are they long face? <laughs> um, so then you would kind of like eyeball between one and two where the chin would hang out, and we know from this picture it's all the way down here. Um, so yeah, this is the Loomis head. All and then the way you down here, yeah. mm -hmm. down and then in Timbuktu. The ear, <laughs> <laughs> the ear hangs out kind of in between, uh, you know, on this nose area. Oh snap, look at that, top of the yeah, ear, bottom it adds, of the ear, yeah. that line. And then this oh. is your kind of your eyebrow line. So your hairline, eyebrows. Her handwriting is amazing. Nose, <laughs> and then your chin. Um, and that's like the head. So we've been doing wow. this every week, um, but it's kind of been um, pretty easy because we've been doing the same head, like it's been kind of the Loomis head just like turned a little bit. So I thought we'd do a little bit of a challenge today um, and do a little, a really cute, hopeful grog, like looking up, ready for the fight, Whoa. looking toward the sky. Um, Handsome. So handsome. Is Why he don't... wearing clothes below the frame? It's up to you to okay. find. We'll That's up there. to you. All right. What does your art heart tell you, Travis? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then, oh, I think I deleted your picture. I was keeping your picture up here as like little reference. So like, I draw cute girls like all day, every day. So I've got a lot of those features like pretty memorized, but. Um, burly barbarians, not all day, every day, mm -hmm. just sometimes. Um, and I'm kind of taking a little bit from your picture. So this is like using reference, but 
um, kind of more as like little elements of it. So like all your like little wrinkles and stuff when you scrunch up your face and do your grog face, like I'm trying to add those in to this. Like I wouldn't kind of have those memorized. So like mm -hmm. I'm gonna keep your photo up there. A wrinkles like or use. angel kisses, right? Angel kisses, oh <laughs> grog's case. Uh -huh. One line for case. every day that Ronan's been alive. My mom told me I was the most handsome boy at school. So <laughs> I'm sure she wouldn't lie to me. <laughs> she would never. Okay, so let's, I'll fade mine. Whoa. And then. It's magic. All right, are you ready? I'm ready. <laughs> I'm ready to dive. We're gonna do a circle. Um, so we're finding, and Grog should be a little bit easier because he's bald, so like you guys don't really, his circle is kind of obvious. So I'm following the curve of his head and I'm just doing a circle. And you guys at home that don't have the underdrawing, just do your regular circle and Crank we'll out get your there. Underdrawing. And he's looking, he's looking up. He's looking up. And we'll, I don't think we'll I kind of go over that. So I don't think I did mine. Where usually the on. circle, um, that side of the face circle is, we were doing it always here, but because his head is tilted, and I think a easier way to find it um, oh, I is get... like considering that brow. So I think have, picking where the eyes go and then treating it kind of like the box. And then that way I know that the circle's kind of tilted this way. That's kind of like where he's looking. Should I get rid of my chin? Did I do a premature chin? Um, No, but I think we're doing, we're doing what we've been doing. I'm trying to challenge you guys and like have that tilted a little bit. Okay, get out of here, Chin. So like that circle, instead of being, you have yours. I hate premature Chin. How we now. have been doing Seriously. it, which is like straight on. <laughs> you know, so like we want it kind of tilted today. So we're gonna do it more like this. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, and maybe, curve this too, as well. This side? Yeah, like mine is like this and yours is going straight up and down. You see oh, that? Oh, I 100% understand. Yeah. Okay. Because that's the side of his oh. head and we're seeing a lot of it because his head's kind of tilted up, like looking right. toward the sky. We're seeing a lot of it. Oh. Is that too fat of a tilty okay. circle? Inside? No, that's great. And like this is all our underdrawing, so like you don't have to get too precious about it. This is just to kind of help us as a guide. So, um, well, there's that hairline, but we don't really need to add that. But I think I'm just gonna put it in just as reference. I think at this angle, you honestly wouldn't really see it. So I'm just following the top of his head for the hairline. Okay. And then, um, again, we're gonna kind of draw this line like a sphere. And like, that's kind of where his nose is gonna hit, is over there. Um, and then the middle of his head, because I have it, because of the way I have it tilted, it's kind of like this, this way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But this one you wouldn't even really see. Right. See, I don't even. You barely see the top of his circle. Ooh. And then that chin. So I'm having it follow down this middle line. That chin though. That chin though. I'm gonna give Grog a big old chin. And I'm kinda like jetting his cheek out a little bit here. Yeah, that's awesome. So that's kind of like what we've got so far. Okay. You okay. got, you're getting there. I'm getting there. We do a little dash for his chin, trying to like carve out his chin. How are you doing? Carve out his chin. Yes. Carve. Look at this guy over here. Oh, people can't really see it real good. Do I need to get? Do I need to start using my darker one? Try the six B. Usually that not shows up. Not the six B. I know. Dabs. They're not ready. It's I'm okay. Not ready. <laughs> you can do it. I believe what if in the you. Universe implodes? Look at this. Look what you did already. What if you sink his what battleship? This, this is going to be fun before and after, I think. Okay. With your instruction? With That's my so instructions. Mm -hmm. So chin. 
Carving out a chin. Yeah. Carving out a chin. This is... This is yeah. fascinating. Thing. Yeah. What's that old saying about like art, really good art students can draw like a perfect circle for a hand or something like that? Is that real? I've never heard of that. Saying. Really? Didn't yeah. like Da Vinci draw like perfect circles or some shit? He might have. Renaissance bastard. Jeez. <laughs> I don't think. I created flying machines before <laughs> they were a thing. <laughs> what an asshole. I researched cadavers <laughs> for human anatomy. Um, I'm adding a little line behind um, his head, his circle here. That's his neck, kind of follows along the edge of that circle down. And then, remember now that chin does sits quite a little bit past this middle line in this uh, circle. Yep. Yeah, you have a little bit for it. Yes, great. Is that, I kind of brought, nice I started students. bringing his. I'm so proud. His chin in, but is this more right or is this more right? I have a I lot of lines I think happening. Like, Honestly, it's gonna be covering a big old beard. So like, okay. and big old beard. Rog's so big and he's so cartoony. I think you have a lot of wiggle room for like how big his chin is and like how thick his neck is and like how big how his shoulders is. are gonna be. It's gonna be a lot like not like how you kind of can can push it a little bit. Right. Then the average human, we can go a little bit cartoonier and weirder and it'll still fly because he's like a giant fantasy creature. <laughs> yeah. Isn't he though? Isn't he though? He's our giant fantasy <laughs> creature though. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna add this. So I've got his shoulders kind of tilted up. So we learned a little bit of this where like, you draw your shoulder line and mine's kind of getting cut off. But this is kind of in my heart. He's kind of doing this like pose like this. So the shoulder's going up on one side. This is kind of just a gut under a guide. Okay. Um, so I'm gonna do is, what's this one? Shoulder line? Flats. Those, yeah, these are your traps up here. Traps. Right, the top of your clavicle. Okay. You get the little shrugs and release. <laughs> Shrug, hold one, two, release. Okay, so Body base. we're drawing some traps. We'll draw big old traps. Oh. And then um, I just spilled coffee like, all down the front of myself. Those traps, yeah, they can be distracting. It's yeah. so oh. distracting. <laughs> Whoa, see that guy's trap? Three traps, bro. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then we'll draw that clavicle in, kind of like crossing over that shoulder line. And then those little, like that little neck triangle, which is gonna be much more pronounced on Krog. Um, Krog. I'm kind of like stretch of that, that out. Get out of here, man. Yeah. Jeez. Big old fat ones. The so deltoid is the top our... of the shoulder muscle. Lateral raises. <laughs> um, you can't draw, you can work out during the show. Yeah. That's true. We were always saying we like learn so much about the body start. on this show. Did, did you just projectile sneeze your phone? My phone across. Okay. Sorry, I feel like I have a hot mess over here. I'm just spilling, <laughs> spilling coffee. Thanks, Steve. Grog will do that That's too. That's looking good. Uh, oh, it's just, I'm allergic. Yeah. Well, let's. Y'all, it's looking great. Yes. Yes. Okay. So we're going to go back into the face. I feel like I'm dipping this too much. Sorry. No, you're fine. It's just an earthquake. It's not me, bad. <laughs> Those are Grog's delts causing that shake. <laughs> <laughs> Please continue. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is it. No more instruction after that one. <laughs> okay, so this eyebrow line, we're gonna draw in some eyebrows. Um, I'm giving Grog big, fat, fun, hairy ones. So I kind of like feel it on out. We're gonna have his eyes set in from here. And I'm kind of giving him this like really determined fun grin. So I'm gonna, they're gonna look kind of angry, but we're gonna have a big grin. It's gonna be more fun loving by the end of it. So I've got them kind of pointed down and then furrowed here. Ooh, that's cool. Yeah. Why is that so like, oh, I'm drawing on top of my red one. Fine. Is that a problem? 
Not for me. <laughs> Not for this one, yeah. Not for this one. Not today, Satan. <laughs> Not today. Um, and then I'm gonna give them big old eyebrows, so I'm gonna have them like coming out past our little head outline a little bit. Oh man, okay. You got this. Okay, it's I got this. It's looking really good. Should I go to a new layer now that I have this situation? Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah for sure. New for layer. Sure. I like this little Nightwing thing going on with his eyebrows. Right? Dude, I'm feeling it. Yeah, I totally do those on Nightwing Fuck too when yeah. I was drawing him for Batgirl. I was like, yes, your symbol on your eyebrows. Um, okay, and then, so there's his eyebrows. And then we'll do the eyeballs. So, in my head, kind of like here. So I'm gonna do a little line like this. So that's like kind of the tear duct and the top lid. Mm -hmm. And then the bottom one's just gonna meet from the bottom from one end to the other. It's just gonna be straight. Cause he's looking up, so like that curve of the eyeball is gonna show at the top and not really the bottom. Cause it's kind of like that bottom's kind of becomes level with your eyesight when his head tilts up like that. Travis, did you take art classes in high school? Yeah, or anything I mean, like that? holy moly. Because. I mean, you can't see it, but it's really good. It's crazy. So there's kind of like a parallel or a line that runs from the top of the Nightwing arch, like kind of in the same line of the face towards the inside of the eyeball. Yeah, the like if, a little if bit. this was like perfect, it would be that whole eyebrow line yeah. would be lined up. Okay. So like, but I'm like kind of correcting it as I go along. So like technically, I guess that would be it. That's cool. Okay. Dope. Yeah, there's all these landmarks on your face that you uh, that kind of Don't tell you all the there. answers, yeah. you know? So like where that eyebrow ends in this, if you follow this line down the side of your face, mm -hmm. that's like, this is where your ear is gonna go. Shit. It's like right in between that two. So You're that's... literally a god. You're like breathing <laughs> life into nothing. <laughs> She's like, and then like a fucking ear appears. Creating, <laughs> creating <Jesus>. matter. <laughs> Damn it. That's amazing. Okay. Um, so yeah. I smell like coffee now, where I just <laughs> spilled it on the front of me. It's like I have aromatherapy of coffee. Yes, how are you doing? My gosh, I barely have to worry about you over here. Uh oh, your head a little bit, watch your head. There you go. Never bringing Travis on as a guest again. <laughs> Should Makes know, me doing look so bad. Good. No, it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> bring Sam on again. Oh, bring Sam. He Sam made me feel Sam good. Sam and I visited the same hypnotherapist before we came. <laughs> we had a trigger, and then we're like, <laughs> brilliance, brilliance, perfect circles. I can draw. You do kind of get this like flash where things just start like clicking. Yeah. And you're like, oh, oh, this isn't as hard as as I was making it out to be. So, we're gonna draw a little iris in. So I'm not gonna have that iris quite touch that bottom line. He's gonna be looking up. And then I'm drawing the, um, the pupil kind of down into the eye a little bit. So it's like not in the middle, but it's kind of a little bit set in because his head's tilted this way. I'm making the pupil tilt a little bit in that way, if that makes sense. But that doesn't make sense. Yeah, kind of like it, it leans into the inside a little yeah, bit. Yeah, like your iris, like it, yeah. it, if you turn it to the angle, your pupil kind of like, yeah. it goes in like this. Oh no, Babs, that was dumb. No, what did I accidentally layer? did on the wrong layer. It's okay, I'll move to it now. Okay. Um, That's okay, you can, you can redo that quick. And it, you've already got it drawn, so you just have to copy it. Yeah. That's true. Oh, that's true. Yeah. I can just go like the, okay. You're fine. And then. That would be great. <laughs> <laughs> I, I had to confess to Babs that uh, for what I would hope are fairly obvious reasons, <laughs> um, I didn't really get to do my homework this you week. You didn't do your homework oh, this week? Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Oh, <laughs> 
to no. work as like a red star. Uh, of all week. the weeks, like this one, you get a pass at. Thanks. You guys have been having a crazy week. Is it I know like what you're talking about? <laughs> no. Totally normal operating procedure around here. <laughs> totally normal week. Yep. Nobody made five thousand dollars or a million dollars or anything. Thank Make sure you kind of tilt this because his head's tilting. Tilt like, his eyebrows? Yes, yeah, so like you're kind of lining them up perfect, but we're gonna, oh. we want to follow that line. Okay. We want to follow that guideline. I oh, I'm see. doing control like, Z on my keyboard and not, it's and it's not. not doing anything. Wait, this is not what I want. This is, I don't want lasso, right? I want free I'm transform. I was just, don't keep uh -oh. that. That's not great. Wait, what did you do? Keep going. There right you go. There. Yeah, just make sure you you are tilting all these features. Is this the, sloping that way? Because that's like the angle of his head. Is this for the free transform like, box? All of these. Is this all of these lines on his head should be kind of going this way. Wait, what am I? How do you how do you do like the free transform features. situation? Oh, it's this one. Oh, oh, and yeah. then I can just mess with it. Yeah, Ooh. and, and if you hold all, um, I don't know actually on the on, on the. One. Mm, try control. I don't know on the PC, but if you hold. Oh, there it goes. There it goes. If and you hold on sense. one of those, you can like stretch. You can like warp it. Well, yeah. That's what I want. Yeah, down, down more. Yep. Yeah. And then around move there more. The whole thing like up a bit. Yeah. Yeah. As long as they're tilting. Let's see, Marisha. Look at mine real quick. All of the features should be sloped, sloped, sloped down. Sloped. Yeah. It's a challenge because we've been doing everything so. I know. I was like, you know what? They're Even getting comfy. They're getting, they're getting too getting good at comfy. that one angle. We're gonna try to switch it up. Yes, great. Look at this. Look at this guy. This guy. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> um, I'm doing the other one now. And we're kind of doing the same thing, but maybe even a little more dramatic. Closer to the, um, closer to that uh, outside of the iris because oh, yeah, it's like it's super even more over. Right, and so the like iris it, is thinner overall. Mm -hmm. or the, yeah. Um, yeah, so it's like close up and then like a little bit further. Yeah, it's just like. <laughs> well, by itself, Sorry, that it's looks so amazing. creepy. That is some Looney Tunes shit right there. <laughs> but those are the eyeballs. Nightmare. Okay. <laughs> Oh, bad. <laughs> cool. you, you didn't meet Scary Terry. Yeah, you have yeah. no idea, Travis. Oh, I, I know who Scary Terry is. <laughs> Did you see? I was oh, yeah, you I were watched. hanging out. You uh -huh. hang out in the chat. That haunted my dreams, no Would problem. you watch the whole show, or you just pop in and say hi? No, I, I pop in for the whole show. I mean, oh. unless, you know, my, my child starts screaming. Oh, yes. Or the dog, That's or my wife. Like, yeah. All my wife. <laughs> Any of them. Why are those dishes? No, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Tell us more. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Go home and get my arrows. Is, okay. Um, and then nice? we're going to feel out the triangle. So, like, because of the angle, um, the nose is going to be a little bit different than we usually do it. So, um, I'm going to kind of put the dot lined up between his eyes and then stick the nose out this way. Ooh. Um, and then the triangle, we're going to draw the triangle in because it's kind of a tilted up, tilted up. We're gonna see the nostrils, so it's like, this would be like where the nostrils are gonna hang out. Yeah, we're getting the good bugs. So you guys, I kind of have this nose angle memorized, so you guys can copy me, or you could like reference, or like look in a mirror and like check it out, but I'll show you what it looks like when your nose tilts that high. So you're gonna want, I'm gonna do this middle line, and then, Travis, you have a really fun nose situation, so I'm gonna kinda take some inspiration from yours. Please. Um, you kinda got this like triangle square thing going on on the tip, and then it kinda goes out and then in, mm -hmm. and then out again, and then. It has a mind of its own. It does, it's really <laughs> fun. I feel like I feel like Hugo definitely took some inspiration. Like, look at this nose and look at Travis's nose. Yeah, that's so cute. Like the, he had to be looking at yours a little bit. Yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah. yeah. 
That's my boy. In my heart, he did. Also, this illustration yeah. of Grog is just like the fucking and the, cutest. In the jam. It was Look at my that favorite sweet, innocent poster. Boy, right? He's so dumb. He's just about to unleash the He's worst so thing so ever. He's so dumb. I love him so much. What, what could it hurt? It's just one little card. <laughs> His energy like makes me think of Gizmo like a little bit. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's my dog. He's like big and furry and dumb. Oh my god, I love your dog. <laughs> Burmese. Burmese Mountain Dog that's and right. a Saint Bernard. Mix. Oh. oh Instagram.com/slash/gizmo/big boy. Yeah, you, can, you can follow Gizmo. <laughs> Plug to Gizmo. Plugging Gizmo. So the outside of your triangle is actually where the like the the bridge line of the nose yeah, is. Yeah, so be. like this is the side of your nose. Word. This is the um this is like this bit. Ooh, let me get on top of that though. This is this bit. So this one's tilted down. So like this would be kind of like what the triangle would look like. Mm -hmm. Katamari style. But this one's tilted up, so we're getting a little bit of the bottom of the triangle there. Mm-hmm. You don't really see the other side of that triangle, but I did a little nostril over there just to see it. Did I do it? Yep, right on top of your picture. <laughs> okay. We're moving so fast. We are. Yeah, sorry. No, it's great. You're doing good. Matt's watching along with us too. Matt, Matt. Our, Matt Mercer. Matt Mercer. Hi, Matt. When are you coming on the show, Matt? <laughs> like he doesn't That's have good. enough to do. Is he? I thought he was working till like five. I thought he was. I thought you were working. Uh -oh. uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> thought you were working. Instead, he's supporting you and watching your show. How <laughs> dare <liar>. you? <laughs> How dare you support me? Matt, I don't know what your skill manner. level is, but maybe when we get more into painting and stuff. Uh, Matt is like, very good. Yeah, and I think I it would be fun. Come back on. I want him to come on for sure. You know, once he's um, like, has a life, I don't know, yeah. you guys are gonna be We're so good. busy. Um, okay. So we've got kind of a nose in. And like, mine's pretty realistic, but you can do a tiny little one like Hugo did. I love this one. You know, Grog is up for a lot of interpretation in his features, so you guys like have fun. Like you don't have to do exactly how I have it, but if you are doing this angle, do consider like, you gotta show the nostrils and stuff like that. Like consider the angle, but you can make that rich straight. You can pinch this in. Here, I'll pinch mine in a little bit. Photoshop, lasso tool. I press command and you can just like make it really tiny. Okay, that's fucking amazing. <laughs> Are you serious right now? I gotta get me one of these Wacom's, man. Dude, it's the jam. Yo, that is so invaluable. Okay, anyway, you can play around with it if you want. I think I might sharpen this little nostril up. We're gonna be doing a big old grin on him, so. I have his. On a normal human, um, that smile would kind of sit in between these eyes. So like you kind of take the middle of the eye and the smile would kind of go here and it wouldn't really go Past. Like the middle of the irises? Yeah, the middle of the irises down. Uh -huh. You don't have to draw that bit. Oh. Um, what if I want him to cry? If you want him to cry, <laughs> you can put it in. Um, but I want to make, I'm making mine a little bit more cartoony, so we're going to do a big old grin. So I'm making mine out here like this. And then I'm going to do it over here. So that's oh, mostly teeth, because okay. this is like wrapping around, this smile's wrapping around, right? So like, This is gonna be mostly teeth, and then you get like the corner here. But a lot of this is gonna be covered up with your mustache, so I'm kind of just sketching it in to get like an idea. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. 
How you doing, Marisha? Yeah, pretty Are good. Are you scared of that nose? Um, well, <laughs> like, like any good plastic surgeon, it's hard to get just right. It's a little scary. Do you want to break it? Want to go over it one more time, a little slower? Maybe. <laughs> no, you're good. I think I you've got that. That's right. You don't need that. You can. This just is use like that a little outline. under kind of drawing that. I, oh, fuck. So I'm just gonna. This is throwing me off. Get, get, get Did out you do with the eyes? No, other other layer, oh, other okay, layer, okay, okay. hiding hiding the layer. Although They're that all. was not what I wanted. I did delete that layer. This so just, just go now. back in your history. There we go. Okay. Are you sure those were just turned off and you didn't delete them? Yeah. Okay. Good. 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 There we are. Okay. Let me know if you I want me to go over those under, when you're like at a point. Okay. Let me get rid of this. This is driving me. Are you still got bunkers? Right yeah. yeah. Is this like the top of the, oh, this is the collarbone, right? Yeah, Ish? this is the, or the top of the. This is kind of just an underdrawing. I was teaching everyone um, mm -hmm. okay. now I can this like here. method if I'm kind of, don't kind of want to feel out their pose, I'll do, for, before I draw the body and stuff, I'll do like this thing where I kind of draw where the hips and the um, arms are doing. Oh, nice. It's so like here, his would be straight. No, oh, that tickles. <laughs> Arnold ref, his would be Ooh. like straight and maybe bent a little. Yeah. And then you kind of do the spine and then. My belly button. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't skip the fun factory, it's right there. You gotta skip it, that's part of the, 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 the technique. <laughs> getting uh, getting um, images of so Arnold. So yeah, you kind of do this and you kind of can feel out a sassy pose. So like, this is really me being like, Just okay, I want his that. shoulders kind of tilted, so. Okay. And it's like the same <laughs> collarbone, clavicle, top of the pectoral. Or yeah. Like, yeah, and like, because he's so, he has so much volume, instead of like his clavicle kind of going straight, you know, that chest is probably big and broad, so like, I kind of have it. <laughs> I kind of have it tilting, you know, down and in, or down and um, out. Mm -hmm. I'm getting there, I'm getting there, Let's step go. by step. Mm -hmm. Let me pause you real quick. Okay. So like it all feels is everything too tiny? No, I think you're making it you're doing oh, that thing where we're going straight again. Oh, where we need to damn. like tilt all right. the features. Right. So his nose is, needs to be tilted. I mean tilty. that's a little extreme. I did that at an angle. Right. <laughs> but you know, you get what I'm saying. I do, I do. So it should all follow like that way. Kinda like that. Oh my god, this is hard. But yeah, so like that even that <laughs> nostril. It's gonna follow that more up that way, yeah. right? So is all this fine? Or this is all fine because you're fine. like doing that at that angle too. Are like his eyeballs too? <laughs> no. Do you, do you ever erase a, erase a line and then just draw it in the exact same place? Yes, like a, a thousand like a percent. Yeah. <laughs> like your brain can see as you're doing it. You're what like, did Sam insane. say that someone we made it into a t-shirt? Half, Half of drawing, drawing is erasing. <laughs> he was on like, the show. He's all like, all of drawing is just erasing. <laughs> Very astute. Marisha, yours is killing it. What are you talking about? Yeah, it's not too bad. Dude, you're crushing. Thanks. Thanks, Foyan. Your pupils are doing um, the opposite. You want them dipping in, into the head. You got them I got out. Him. <laughs> yeah. Look, he's just. I look like he's got like were werewolf cat, cat eye style. Grog had a fantasy. Grog. About his werewolf life. Oh, uh, keep going. So, <laughs> I'm ready. Well, crisp, crisp night. What? Maybe, maybe um, some snow. Paint us maybe a word picture. Ooh, yeah. Okay, um, so we got a smile in there. I'm gonna draw on him some ears real quick. So the top of the ear, I'm gonna have follow that um, line inside that circle that's splitting it in half. No. What just happened with that? And kind of give them tiny, tiny ears. Okay. I just think it'd be funnier. Well. And I have it going a little bit past the um, circle. His nose, like the bottom of that, like circle. Yeah. Okay. Oh man! And I've got your ear for reference today. Usually I'm making this up. But we've got some. You got the real thing. We got the real. 
motherfucking deal. What? Oh. Little ear. Okay. Get rid of that. Let's get out Hugo's grog because it's so cute, and I want to do that beard. Once I tilted the nose, the rest of it didn't look right. So I'm going to try again. But that Let's bottom see. of the nose looks good, though, Marisha. This part looks good. Yeah, I think get, it looks get, better. Get, for get, sure. get, get, stop. And then, like, the middle, you want, might want to draw. No, it's fine. This looks good. Can I give, him, like some, a can I give him some air rings? Yeah, give put in some, some earrings. Does he have, is he got, that? He got like this big cross earring from his time down in Miami. What? Girl, <laughs> it's on the chain. <laughs> That's fine, right? That's great. Scan it, it's scan it yeah. now. It's official. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna draw in some beard. Mm, I'll start with the one around his mustache, so we'll do. I'm just kind of following the the mouth line. And it's a lot like hair where beards have like a little bit of volume. So I'm having it go a little hair. bit away from his face and then kind of down and then. It looks like Jokerish as you're starting it. <laughs> yeah. And then down, like another line, you know, down from the corner of his mouth. So you kind of want to consider it wrapping. You look like Hulk Hogan or something right now. Oh my now. God, I'm okay with that. <laughs> Hulksters, Hulkamaniacs, have your vitamins, <laughs> say your prayers. Yo, that's more macho, man. That's yeah, kind of whatever. It's wrestling uh, vibes in general. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm gonna give a little bit of, a little bit of spiky hair off your mustache for my grog. There's not any on Hugo's, but I'm adding it for mine. You guys can kind of get creative with the end of your mustaches if you want, I think. Mm -hmm. Yes, Marisha, good. I'm filling him in just yeah, a little bit good. here. Make that eyebrow stick out, and then I'll do a little cheek there too. Um, and then the bottom of the mustache, I'm just gonna add a little, little texture, kind of like we did when we were going over features, guys, where you kind of add these like little swoops. It kind of makes it look more like hair. Hair, Hugo did a little bit with like that little loose hair in the middle. You can see. I got distracted by looking at Hugo. <laughs> okay, and then we'll do, since the top lid's kind of Definitely covered by the beard. We'll do the bottom of the mouth, which is not covered by the beard. So I'll just kind of draw it underneath your mustache you just drew in. Right, so that top lip will disappear kind of, right? You're not, yeah, you don't really not see it. Okay. Mm -mm. So I'm gonna even delete that mouth because I, oh, nope, I'm gonna keep it. How'd you start with his mouth? Um, Just a big old, yeah, like you, you know where his nose is, so you can kind of like follow your thing here, and then you kind of know where the mouth is gonna end because of the middle the of the eye thing. Right. So like you can do a little like, it's around here, and then you can do a little measuring with your landmarks and kind of like, you know, kind of like Make feel it box. out. I yeah. see, I see, I see. So like, and then it's still you guys this. just consider your landmarks and all the, face knowledge you know already, you should be able to kind of find the mouth. So it kind of comes up to that corner. Okay. okay. And then I'm gonna do a bottom lip here. <laughs> yeah. I love awesome. it, he's coming together. <laughs> I'm gonna, um, Move mine around a little bit. Okay. Um, and then, you know, Travis, your beard kind of does the same thing. So we're gonna do this middle pair and then leave kind of these little, little empty spaces right here. 
Oh, I see. Okay. So that's what that is. That's crazy. So Hugo has little ones, but I'm doing big ones. Um, and then it's amazing the way that you see shapes as an artist, right? Dude, Just everything. little, little fractions of a piece of a picture. Yeah, I've been, and that's what we've been preaching on the show. Like everything around you is shapes, and if you can just like teach your brain to boil down everything you see into like the most simple shape, you can draw anything. Like aim small, miss small. Yeah, yeah. 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 Um. Okay. I'm gonna do a little cheekbone by his ear, like that, and then you know draw this one over here. Again, those should be those would be following that line, right? So like that top of that cheekbone <laughs> is over here, and this bottom one would reach over here. So that's kind of like why this one bends, and then this one bends. That's what they look like far away. Come back to me. Where are those? Here we go. Uh oh, I drew some on your picture layer. Whoop. This is so relaxing. Is yeah. it? For real. Like, what? you have the exact opposite it. energy of Sam. I think he was stressed out from what a day. Stim, Sam. Minute one to the very last Sam minute. Sam was so nervous. <laughs> but he did a great he job. He did so good. And he was so proud afterwards. Could you tell? I couldn't really tell. Oh, yeah. When he was like, can I take this home? <laughs> no one and will believe show me. my wife and kids and put it on my fridge. I was like, <laughs> yeah. So oh, cute. that's really cute. Yeah. Is that a mount? Is that? Yeah. Why does everything feel weird? Let me see. Chief, will you pull me up? Yeah. <laughs> okay. What's happening? So I it think... just feels like everything's a little off. <laughs> It's actually no. not too bad. Yeah. Too the bad. mouth is a little bit off. Oh my gosh, your keyboard is not my keyboard. <laughs> I keep trying it is the control. to touch mine. If you do control for the, there you go. <sighs> no windows. PC! <laughs> yeah, go control. Push you off Okay, here we go. Scum. There you go. It okay. just needs to be there tilted it is. Up. So like, I was, this line should match up with, uh, just should make you cheat a little <gasps> bit. It should let me I did up. it though. Right? I kinda did it. Yeah. Well, it matched. It matched after I adjusted it a little bit. Well. <laughs> Damn. You did it. Yeah, I did it. <laughs> but yeah, that's a, that's a good cheat when you have these straight lines and it should all kinda line up. Okay. So like, okay. that's good and then, I think you could even go further in on the side of the mouth. Would help it like a little bit. like Not be so. Yeah, there you go. In his face, okay. Dope. Sorry, I know I need to stop drawing on Marisha's, but I know it's the good. show's only an hour and a half, guys. No, is it really? <laughs> How much, what time are we at right now? Uh, we have about 30 more, no, 40 more minutes. Oh, okay. thank okay. God. We gotta get down to the fun factory. Okay. <laughs> Um, Kidding. we're doing some, <laughs> so this is gonna let that fly. Is, sternum, all right? is that Just where relax, it is? ladies, jeez. <laughs> okay, we're doing big beard, big, big beard big stuff beard. now. So I'm just doing a few lines up by his ear for his sideburns and then we're kind of jetting out for the beard. And it's a lot like hair, right? So like, I'm just kind of finding this shape. I want his, Kind of be a big triangle, Ooh, a big awesome. weird triangle. So like, I guess it's not even what. How many sides is this? Yeah. Yeah, kind of like a triangle. So like, I know that's the general shape I want it. And then you just go in and you kind of like add some of these little hairs. I love this ring that Hugo added to your beard. I'm gonna add it too. Wow. And then. <laughs> Look at this guy. This guy. I love him. Travis, I love grog. Me too. <laughs> Everybody needs some grog in their life. He's so good. You need that Joey-like friend, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's Joey's. So, um, now we've got his beard done, I'm gonna go in and add a little more detail to his face. So like, I'm gonna add your little under eye guys over awesome. here. 
and then um, you kind of got this like furrow going on around your your um, forehead. So I'm kind of adding some of that in. Thank you, Chris Lockie, for the photo too. Thank you, Chris. Thank you, Chris Lockie. Chris. He gave me some reference photos for you of you. Um, yeah, so I'm just kind of like, this is kind of these little wrinkle details because my default is hot ladies. I like don't have memorized. So like <laughs> when you bring up um, having a little reference photo, even if it's not the right angle, but it, you know, it's kind of like I'm taking inspiration from your, your real face. So it's like good to have as reference. Mm -hmm. Yo, you gotta invest in some erasers, right? <laughs> oh Give, man. Giving them work. Yeah. Did, does he have the uh, the funsies ones? The tiny ones? You do have yeah. the tiny ones. Yeah, mm. the little detail ones. Mm -hmm. That mouth is crazy big though, Travis. We might have to shrink it. He's fucking happy, Barbs. <laughs> All right, you know what I'm saying? Whoa, he called you Barbs. Barbs. <laughs> yeah, Barbs. Barbs. Like my family, uh, you can tell how long someone's known me because they'll switch between Barbara and Babs. Because I didn't start doing Babs until like high school. Is that right? Yeah, I was just like, Babs is fun, it's Babs now. And my, all of my old friends in my family are like, uh, okay, I got Barbara. Some, I gotta call you Barbs now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Please. <laughs> Babs is fun. Babs, Babs is like your fun aunt or grandma. Yeah. <laughs> Barbara's your not fun aunt or grandma. Yeah, fun is the key <laughs> phrase though. Let me, let me, okay. I think if, because your features are so big over here, I think if we made all of this come out more, it would balance out this without way? you having, yeah, like, um, here, I'll just do it really lightly. Yeah. Let me look at yours real quick. I think just yeah. making them like a little bit bigger will kind of compensate for how big you drew his features, which is nothing wrong. Like you guys just have to keep like, kind of keep an eye on your stuff and you can totally compensate as you go, I think that might, I think that might help. Okay. So er erase this and polish up what I did. And then okay. um, I think that's gonna help your drawing like a lot. Sure. Oh, Marisha, he's looking great. Thanks. Give him an ear. He's he, little, can't, he can't hear anything. He <laughs> can't hear anything. <laughs> and you know, those silent spells, dumb's rough. <laughs> um, Okay, I have to give him an ear. Let me, let me, no, you're right. I have to give him an ear before I finish his beard, don't I? Yeah, and you know where it goes. It's gonna go in between this area and this area, and it's gonna end right here where you have the chin. It's just so uh, uh, scary when you tilt it. And he's I know. Looking so at it. This is gonna way. be different than, because his ear's on this plane. Mm hmm. Can you go ahead Can and bring we do me Marisha's up? real quick? Marisha's screen? Yeah, he's looking great. So because you're on this plane, his ear is gonna be on this, oh, the control Z on my computer. It's gonna be on this line. So like your guides are gonna be, so his ear's gonna sit around there. there. And if, okay. Sorry, that looks so bad. I'm working on an angle on your screen. Yeah, no, for It'll sure. It'll sit in that area. Okay. And you know that because we've learned that from the Loomis, it's gonna sit in, in that between that eyeball and the nose. Thanks, Loomis. Thanks, Loomis. You did a good job. <laughs> what, what, what? Okay. Hey, calm down, calm down. I'm gonna oh, just I'm just. What am I having? What am I? This circle. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he's just a little bit filled out now. And like, you can move that edge of that beard over now, too. This one? Yeah, I would move it over. Oh, no, yeah, because yeah, you got it coming out over there. I don't line. even think you'd see much of his neck, honestly. Yeah. Because it's so big. Because <laughs> it's so big. The belt of dwarven kind is no joke. No joke. <laughs> Roll that kind of saber, bro. <laughs> Travis, I'm really sad you didn't go, pop draw, like when you came on. <laughs> No. <laughs> oh, fuck. Opportunity missed, Next man. Time. Next time. Oh, right. But I was like, Babs what has if been he does waiting it? for that what moment. What if he does it, though? <laughs> what is it? Oh. That's all right. I'll get it in the clothes. <laughs> okay, good, good, good. 
<laughs> okay, I'm gonna just lighten sure my outline a little bit. Here hasn't been done. I'm getting ahead of myself. This is, I, I think it's just throwing me because it's an it's an ear at a different angle than what we've done. <laughs> yeah, plus you're making it huge. Is it big? It's a little big and remember, so like this plane, like pretend the ear is gonna sit in that plane because of those angles, so you're still drawing it straight on. Right. But it would, it would really be like, it would really be tilted this way and you're drawing it straight on. You see what I'm saying? Yours is going this way. Right. We need it going. So you need more oh, well, of like. Oh, I drew it the wrong way. You need more like the flat side of the ear. It's gonna follow that line, so. <laughs> trying to look at people's ears. <laughs> I think it's just your angle. Yeah. And you're just wrong for weeks. <laughs> Listen guys. What I do in my spare time, <laughs> Look at this what I cat. obsess over. <laughs> okay. Um, okay. Okay. So the, the 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 fatter side of the ear. So it's gonna there. that's gonna be the top of the ear. Mm -hmm. That's the top the of the bottom. ear. So it's so much tinier than they normally are. I know. It, it feels like. You can make it bigger. Because it's, it's clearly a taste of mine, but I think you still need to make the top of the ear on that angle. So it looks like it's wrapping around his head. Right, because right, it's further away, technically. No, it's closer to I feel like I'm mixing some Oh, sweets. yeah, yeah, it's further away. Just... So like, if everyone's struggling, if you picture the head as a box, right? Actually, I like your line in the back. This is kind of like the angle of Grog's like head. Does this help, Marisha? Like it does. visualizing like this, so like the ear is gonna sit back here, and then the eyes are like on this like line. This is like so bananas, and that's like the nose, right? That's like kind of the angle we're working with. Is like you were a... still drawing the ear, not tilted at all, where you need it. Tilted a little bit. Happy back. That helps. Is it like it a happy not... accident that, that like the line for like the point of the top of the head is right over his eye? Is that just like a coincidence? The point to the top. Yeah, of Yeah, like his you head. know, like there's kind of like this line, and then it comes to, like even on yours, it's right. Oh, these points. Yeah, and then like this one too at the top. I mean, that's not really a point, but. Um, I'm just kind of like thinking how. So if you take the human head and. Um, it's like a ball, but you really, it's really more like an oval. So like I'm kind of chopping this whole side off. So like instead yeah. of being perfectly round, I'm going straight and then curving it for the top of his head. And then like you kind of come down here a little sharper than a prayer circle because it's going straight again on right. the other side of his head. And then the point just kind of adds some character Bald heads, all, like bald heads, come also in all kinds of shapes and sizes. So you guys can get a little creative too with that. But added a little little point to the top of his just to add some character. Yeah. It's coming along. It's coming along. Does that make sense? Do you? I feel like. Yeah. Kind of. It's like. Because if it clicks in your head, then it'll you'll be able to like do it on your own later easier. Like even more like. This line feels too, like, should this be more like that? Yes. Got it. Yes, queen. Art, <laughs> heart. Okay. I hope y'all's grogs are going okay. And How are your grogs? I'm In fact, if your little. grogs aren't going okay, just take a moment and hug yourself. <laughs> yeah. well, uh, wrap your arms around and give a tight squeeze. <laughs> And just say, Pike loves me. <laughs> Everything is okay. Oh my god. I feel better. Don't. I do. And Life coach Grog. Yeah, I love it. We will get foodies together. <laughs> it's so cute. Um, okay. I'm gonna outline some of these muscles a little bit. I'm gonna add 
had this crazy, what is this shoulder thing called again? What were you, what's it? The deltoid? No, no, the um. Oh, a pauldron. The a pauldron. Isn't that right? I think yeah. that's right. What, what part? The shoulder armor. Oh yeah, pauldrons, pauldrons yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's giveaway time. <laughs> Give <laughs> it's giveaway time in our chat. Uh, you know. I missed that. What happened? Uh, Max almost just, fell over. Huh? To get your attention. Uh, <laughs> we're giving away a, a walk of Mentos, you guys, in the chat. I'm about to give you a keyword. Only enter it once. If you enter it more than once, you will be disqualified. Right now, the offer is only good for residents of the United States and Canada, excluding Quebec, for the official rules that I do not make. Sorry, Quebec. Follow the yes. link in the chat or go to critroll.com. The keyword is oil. Oh, that's a good one. <laughs> Keep an eye on your whispers, and we will close the contest and announce a winner in about five minutes or so after I figure out how ears work. <laughs> no, you got it. I'm getting there. It. It's like there. It's just now it's like the rest of it. But like, I'll get there. Yeah. Um. Well, it's still going to be a little bit smush. Smush, smush, more smush? Yeah. What is on this? Leave layer? some room for his sideburns and stuff. So this like, is... you'd want it to follow this jawline. So I think the the shape is good, you just need to like move it over. You can, that's how you do it. Yeah, so like the ear should always kind of be connected to this this like jaw side. The the little low B part? Yeah, the lobe always is gonna be at the where your jaw, your jaw meets your Oh, hand. right. Yeah. Oh, right. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh. <laughs> So proud of my uh, students. Adults. <laughs> adults. We're good pupils. So I'm doing just a little hint of your pauldron. And pa -pa 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 pauldron. And what is pauldron? <laughs> oh my god. American hero. Rubbing his name through the through the, the dredges of pub draw. You're welcome. The dredges thanks for exploring. of pub draw. Thanks for, <laughs> thanks for exploring space for us. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Sorry, Buzz. Okay. There's, there's really no dredges to this show. There's Is this no like the most wholesome, to our clean, pub relaxing draw? thing we have? Yeah. Yeah. Unless yeah, Sam's on. Is. That's true. And talks about our sex music the whole time. He did. He yes. Did keep... This is way too slow for that. I'm like. I mean. <laughs> That's some like bear rug fireplace Aspen, Colorado, 1984 stuff. I don't know what's going on in that. Okay, I'm gonna add a little teeth. I, I love how the judgment wasn't that he talked about sex music. It was that you can <laughs> serve this, this sex tempo. Music. Yep. Come on, come on. Okay. Yeah, girl. Yeah, we can draw your picture. Okay. Got your picture. Got your picture. <laughs> Where's that beard layer? There's the beard layer. Okay. So here's our grogs, looking very cute. Okay, back to the damn, back to the damn beard. Um, um, let's do. How you doing? Okay. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Now yes. it's now it feels like uh, I got through a hurdle, and now it's now it's beard time. Yeah. So. So this is just like. Do what we did, like I was telling everyone earlier, uh, kind of like. Do the like shape. Do a light. Yeah, do some light lines of like kind of where you kind of want, him, want, it, to want it to go. Like mine's doing this shape, but like Krog's beard is like super up to interpretation. You guys can do whatever kind of beard you want with his, don't That's you true. think? Yeah, it's allowed. It's allowed. Go have fun. Yeah, go wild, right? Go wild. Maybe some shitty rogue elf like shaved half of it. I don't know. <laughs> No big. <laughs> oh my god, I hope that I hope that goes that into, comes in. I hope it comes I hope some stretch goals are met. That's all I got. <laughs> Can I ask you a question? Yes. So because we opened up, we spaced out right this from here to here, should his cheek uh, bone kind of extend to the side of his ears like yours does? Is that too much of a space between cheek um, and ear? Let's see. Mine's pretty close. But uh, mine's kind of foreshadowing a little bit. I feel like the angle you drew yours looks kind of, it looks fine to okay. me. You could move, like, 
this beard would probably follow the edge of his ear a yeah, little more. Up, so you right? can move that over. Yeah. I think that's probably what is throwing you off. And you can even draw it in, you know, in front of your, your ear a little bit because it would probably be overlapping it a little bit because it's like big and fluffy, right? It is. If anything, it's big and fluffy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, absolutely. It oh, we got a winner. Fluffy. Oh my goodness, we have a winner. Jimmy. Congratulations to Galvia. You Yay. are getting a new into a. Congratulations. Congrats. That's amazing. Draw on it. Send us what you draw on it. Yeah, let's see. Let's see what you do. Yeah. Okay, moving on. Okay. Okay. I'm feeling. I'm feeling pretty. I'm feeling pretty good. I'm feel, starting to feel. You know. You feeling good? Feeling I'm better? Feeling so good. He's looking really good. Not too bad. Looking really happy. Let's see. <laughs> Let me see yours for a second, Trav. <laughs> <laughs> he's got um, fangs. He's got fangs. <laughs> I told you he wanted to be a werewolf. <laughs> um, <laughs> let me look at it real quick. Yeah, you could do that or just straight ones. You know, whatever you want. Oh, longer fangs? You're right. Yeah, longer. Right. longer. It's all about taking, <laughs> it's all about taking risk, right? <laughs> it is pub draw. You guys have fun. <laughs> but drug. <laughs> Have fun, but you better not disappoint me. <laughs> um, I'm filling in my grog beard, and then I think I'll do some tattoos next. Feeling myself. I'm. I'm feeling myself. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. I swear, I feel like this show just gets the most quiet from us. <laughs> it's we good. We are never this quiet, <laughs> ever. It's good. I hope so. I hope Paul, people aren't bored. Awesome. No. Yeah, so I'm just doing a little shadow. Is his eyes black? Are they black? Um, they've gone between being blue and like jet black, sometimes red. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I'm what kind of what kind of red ones? What kind of ale do you have? <laughs> let's let's game this out. <laughs> I'm gonna do like I would like to rage with a big smile eyes. Yeah. for you guys to catch up, we'll do some tattoos. Sorry. No, you're fine. I'm excited for tattoos. They're just, I think they'll be a little bit tricky because of our angle. Right. Um, so I wanted, I don't want you guys to watch when I do Because it's them. not like, you can't rely on symmetry. Really? Yeah, yeah, because it's the angle's so different. When do you know when to stop with the drawing, Babs? When are you like, that's done? Um, it depends on kind of my goal at the beginning, maybe. If I know it's, like I'll do these OOTDs and I'll know I don't have to go too tight with them. Or if I'm having a lot of fun, I'll just keep going. Right. Um, or if it's like a cover, I'll keep going. Or uh, depending on how much I'm getting paid, I'll keep going. <laughs> or if I really love the content, I'll really go overboard. Just, yeah. Um, what? You know, what even do you mean? If, even if like the pay isn't good, I'll like put in extra love because I like love love what I'm doing and um, my brain goes a little businessy and I'm like, well, if I make it really good, even though they're not paying me, I can like make prints of it and. Like make money on top of money. Yeah, no, that's smart. <laughs> keep that in mind. Yeah, my my brain does that a lot. <laughs> I'm like, how can I stretch this out? Well, and then I'm sure it's also, you know, 
Same in the artist industry, like if you do good and work fast, then they'll bring you back next time when maybe they have more money or. Yeah. Um, if you like liked working with them and stuff. There's like a freelance saying where it's like if you're, I wonder if it's the same for voice acting. Oh, 20 minutes. Um, if you're like fast and kind and oh, good. Yeah. So you yes. can only you can be two of those the at triangle. one time, and they'll probably still hire you again. Yes. Um, you can be, but you can't like let one drop, or you're gonna you're gonna fuck you're it gonna up. Gonna go fuck it up. Can I ask a shading question? Yes. Tell Looks me. Looks like there are triangle shades coming off of his nose, like to the top of his mustache. Is that right, or is it just underneath stuff like this stuff? Oh yeah. So I just figured his big cheek is probably casting, casting a shadow. Shade. Yeah. Okay. But make sure you don't get too dark with it. Yeah, right. Like Maybe fill in his beard and, and then see how dark you need to do shadow. That'll kind of give you your tonal oh, range. Right, right. Um, have you inked before, Travis? Do you want to try inking? What the hell is inking? Yeah, with like a pen. Permanent shit? Yeah. Bad. Okay. No. Too much confidence? No, no, I don't know. Let's do I don't care. Let's roll. Let's. Let's do Let's the tattoo. Let's place. do the oh, tattoo man. first. Let's do the tattoos first. We got 20 minutes. I'm ready. 20 minutes. Oh, I love his beard. Thanks. It's a little swooshy. It's really I swooshy. Gonna, I was thinking about like, but I wanted to do it. Right <laughs> He's like Viva El Sassoon over here with his like, oh, just shaking it. Dude, shining. Marcia, that's great. Thanks. The kids just, okay. It's been a long week. <laughs> Telling you guys. Uh, what happened? <laughs> <laughs> Did something good happen? City bit. It's just a day. It's just a city bit. <laughs> just uh. Man, I'm kind of. I haven't practiced braids since we've done them, but yeah, I'm sure. Um, a sentence I've never said. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't practiced braids, braids since, since I've we've done, done them. Kind of like this, and then yeah, yeah. Oh, I kind of had it. Yeah, you're pretty close. If you guys want to add some braids on your grog beards, there you go. Okay, we're gonna draw some tattoos. I think you guys can also take some liberties with his tattoos, because so many people have drawn them so many different ways. Like here's kind of two different, you know, like your face paints, like they're kind of big and chunky, and over here they're kind of like thinner. Yeah. Um, and even your shoulder ones are so, so different. So I think he was real bloated on that one. <laughs> was he bloated? Yeah. Well, you know, ale is not exactly like a slimming thing. <laughs> I don't know how you feel when you walk out of a bar at two in the morning. Oh boy, <laughs> ain't no salad bar. <laughs> okay. So we'll just kind of like I'm gonna gently sketch in kind of where I think I'm gonna put my tattoos. So no matter what you do, I think you just gotta consider the form of the face. So like. This is all cylindrical and round, so it's gonna kind of like wrap around his head, so they're gonna be really in perspective here. So I've got this one on the side of his eye, and then this one coming down the middle, which is easy enough. You just kind of have to follow in between the eyebrows, move up. And then this one you're just barely gonna see, because yeah. it's like wrapped around his head. And then I'm So gonna... as long as you kind of keep <clears throat> Going with the shape yeah, of the head. Yeah, exactly. Just keep keep okay. Come uh, back, keep in mind that the form of your your head shape, and then I'm gonna do kind of one down here, continuing. Well, that's awesome. Yeah. Shit, this is breaking my brain even. Okay, it would go a little <laughs> bit like this, and then like this. So I just flipped that shape from one way to the other, over here. Okay. And then I'm just gonna fill this in. God, these are like 
tribal tattoos, those really cheesy 90s ones. What'd you say? These <laughs> tattoos. Fuck it. Say what? <laughs> Come correct. They're no. really cool. <laughs> Thus ended Barb's tar. <laughs> <laughs> Super so, cool, all right? So cool. Grog really wanted some barbed wire on his upper bicep. <laughs> right. Just be glad he chose. And the face is bad. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm sorry if anyone has barbed wire tattoos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> sure, it's Super cool. Super cool. Yep. Um, <laughs> okay. If I could pull it off. Do you have them? Barbar bar tattoos? <laughs> yeah. No. But uh, you, got, you got to have like the guns to pull off those bad boys. Barbed wire. Yeah. I, so like in Motor Crush, I gave a couple thugs those tattoos. Um, that is amazing. Because like to entertain myself drawing characters like thugs, because I kind of get, they're not important enough they're not like super important to like give full character give full design. Character. And... I mean, if I was, if I had a million hours, I would sure. put the care into all of them. But it's a monthly. It was a monthly comic, so like that was not going to happen. But I'll do things like I'll put them in bad clothing and I'll give them bad choices in fashion. So like at least viscerally, people would get the idea that they're like not any good. Right. <laughs> I, I love your your moral code. Is their fashion was ratchet, <laughs> so they're off. So you bad know they're people. shitty people. Ratchet. <laughs> in Nova Honda, in Motor Crush, that is the law. In my world, I build. There we go. What's this middle one going on? There's got to be something cooler. Oh, just a big V. Not just a big V, <laughs> all right? It is the, the, the big V. Sometimes that's arrow. the last thing people see before they expire. That's very true. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I've seen these drawn all kinds of different ways, so you guys feel free to like have fun. No, sorry. Sorry, eyebrows, I didn't mean to get you. And then... Draw some of the shoulder ones over here. Oh yeah. Oh, I gotta get the red up in there. What do you mean right. there's no more chicken parmesan at the buffet? Yeah. <laughs> Make sure, so that's gonna be his middle one, so it should kind of fall in between his eyebrows. Like here is. Just kind of aim it to his eyebrows. Yep. Yeah. What? Oh. What'd I do? Carry on. Carry on. <laughs> Nothing to see at all. I think I'm good with my trap as reference. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Task curve. Task curve that one. Task curve, task curve, task curve. It's okay. Erase, I, I'm like a 5.5 .5 magnitude earthquake <laughs> on this table. You should have. Uh, it is the most vigorous eraser we've gotten so far. Nothing, uh, I don't know. Sam. Sam was a chalice. Guess, yeah. <laughs> but it was just true. so much for like the entire episode. I just kind of you got it. used yeah. to it. Thank you, 10. 10 minutes. We got. We did it again, Babs. I know, we didn't get to everything. <laughs> but we do have a really great grog. We've yeah. got great grog yeah. portraits. And we can do body, grog body stuff next time. 
It's hard to get to that body stuff. Um, and we still did a little bit with, but I think it's good. This is, we had Percy, um, but I think it's good. We got like a really masculine kind of like burly dude in totally. two. Totally. Wait, why did, don't do that. Photoshop. So, Babs. Yeah. When you're drawing any of our characters, mm -hmm. what's the most irritating thing to have to draw when you're drawing anyone from Critical Role? Um, Campaign one or two. Who is annoying to draw? Like, what's the most, like, like you were like, oh, Grug's tattoos are hard and I think, I think because they're so fantasy, the the um and the proportions are so I'm not used to them, the the um like pike and scandalin are a little bit tricky. Oh, with the gnomes? Yeah, because their heights their their proportions are different because they're so short. So like do I draw them stockier or like do they have child like how do I not make them look like child Kids. bodies? Right. That's tricky. That takes me a little bit of time. Interesting. Um, but it's mostly super fun because I like adore the character so much. It's just like, it's like a, uh, I, I, I gladly take on that challenge, you know? Because yeah, we were, we've been talking about how it's hard to find time <clears throat> to draw for fun. Yes. Especially me, it's like a job, so it's it's tricky to keep it, um, tricky to keep the fun, and like give myself permission to like take the time to have fun. Like, and same with you with your homework that you you know you have a hard time to get squeeze in every week. Right. Like, I'm not getting paid for this. Like, right. it's like when there's scripts. But I think you just gotta like find the joy in it. Yes. You know, like. If you're not like super psyched about the homework, just like have fun and do something non pressure -y. Like whenever I feel like, <laughs> whenever I feel like super stressed out, I'll draw something just for me, like, like Sailor Moon or like my outfit of the day or something. <laughs> just take a dance break every once in a while. Mm -hmm, take a dance break. Can't figure it out. It's pretty good. We're almost out of time. Oh, you got that amazing, like, of of atmosphere in the back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. It does a lot. That, that's the other thing. I see so many of our fan <laughs> artists do <laughs> stuff like that. <laughs> <laughs> you could do it really quick. Really? Yeah, like, you could just. Yeah? If the red or are your brown or your black, but I think the red might have them pop out more. Just like real fast. Yeah. A little atmosphere. I see people do that and it seems like um, everyone kind of has their own like style for that too. Totally, totally. Which is cool. Like a lot of my like, if I do a background commission, I'll do like a big red circle. Like maybe he's like watching his enemies burn and I'm doing some ambers. <laughs> <laughs> Just watching his enemies burn. God, I'm back in, back in <laughs> shading. I love it. How do you like it? He turned out pretty fun. This is so, so freaking fun. His beard is really flippy. I'm really into it. He's got a little. <laughs> they took his curler and he was like. That is so good, Trap. You gave him shoulder sure. tattoos too. <laughs> Get that far. You guys.
How'd your grogs turn out, guys? How did everyone's grogs turn out? Post them online. Use the hashtag PubDraw on Twitter. There he is. Babs and I love, love going through the hashtag. I think we scared some people with the body. I feel like barely anyone posted. I'm sorry, guys. Oh, yeah, we're sorry if it, it <laughs> was more thin. You're totally right. It was thinner. But I'm sorry if we freaked you all I'm out. I'm sorry if we freaked you out or if that was super hard. I know, and it's not as fun that straight on pose. So like next week when we do the body, we'll go over a grog because there's obviously not time. And then we'll maybe do like a one, of a pose from one of your photos or something. Okay, I'm into that. And then, yeah, it's just me and you again next week. Yeah, so it'll be like practice. Thank you, five. Um. Travis, do you like, were you, did you ever enjoy drawing as a kid? So much. So aside Obviously. from, aside from my parents sticking me in like every sport they possibly could to drain the ADD out of me, oh. you know, I'd go to like soccer and then straight to gymnastics and then straight to something else and then get dropped off at like the PE center and just run myself stupid. <laughs> and then one of the rooms had like a charcoal class. Oh, cool. So, oh, charcoal's yeah. so fun. So cool. You can get so much down so fast with charcoal. Yeah, yeah. I, I was teaching Marisha, I was like, we were doing a little life drawing um, last week and I was like, we should do a life drawing class together. Yeah, um, let's put the fruits up there and like put a lamp on it. And... <laughs> yeah, I guess we could. Yeah. It was really fun. It is fun, it's like free therapy. It's just chill as hell. Yeah. So if you can't, if you're feeling stressed out, maybe that's when you like do your homework, just like take a minute for yourself and be a little selfish. Yeah, that's kind of what I've been using it for. Yeah. Like just taking a moment, um, you know, trying to use it like, I'm, I'm really bad about stopping to like eat lunch. I'll just like shove food in my mouth and keep going. Yeah. I'm trying to get better at like, when I'm on a lunch break, like <clears throat> just, taking a minute to draw a little bit, or like in my morning coffee before the day gets so chaotic that it's hard to justify stopping. I'm just copying Babs. Yeah, just have just fun. Like blood and particulate in the air. <laughs> I was thinking it's like ashes. It's blood, it's definitely. It's blood, it's splattered, yeah. it's splattered oh, blood. Cool. Mm. Every time I look up, Something's happened, <laughs> I'm telling you. We just got to get... We just I wanna to put splatter on his fun. face. <laughs> if you do that, you be <laughs> really careful. <laughs> we spent a long time on that drawing. <laughs> <laughs> do not like ruin it. it with your blood not splatters. Okay. <laughs> I don't know if I need any of those white ones. I gotta get rid of that chin, Mine. Yeah, clean up your underdrawing. Travis, he looks great. He's so cute. I love his fangs. Oh my goodness, I love him. All right, guys, I think that's our episode. So let's do our do our little review. Let's go Travis full box first. <laughs> yeah, looking good. Oh, oh my God, look at his cracks on everything. <laughs> Get, get no, out. It's, a it's a children's show. <laughs> <laughs> it looks great. Are you proud? I am very proud. He's super Look fun. Yeah, he's a happy boy. I love it. Who may have been bitten by a vampire. This, it looks so fluffy over here from all your like shading. It's great. Thank you for coming on. Thank Travis. you. Yeah, you're such a great Thank teacher. You, Travis. Good try. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> Chief, if you want to show off what I did, but it's not not too bad. It's really not, Marisha, that's, it. That? oh, I love the braid in the middle. <laughs> braid. Yes. <laughs> well, it's not too bad. I, I, I was, think it's one of your best drawings so far. Thank too. you. That oh one and your Keyleth one are like one of my, some of my faves. I was feeling so shaky when I, when I came in today for the, the well, episode kind because, of, kind of fast too. well, yeah, we didn't get to like, like I said, I didn't, I freaked out you guys. I was telling Babs before the episode because I didn't practice at all and I was like, <laughs> I don't know how to draw anymore. She really was. She it's was practicing done. and like yeah. so I, lost. It went. Kickstarter like, happened. Drawing went away. There yeah. was. 
Um, That's but, totally understandable. And then it, but this. Uh, I'm it, impressed it, we got yeah. anything done tonight, guys. Like yeah. with y'all, the week y'all got y'all had so far. Yeah, yeah. I was telling you, I wish I wanted to get mylar balloons and said like five milli. <laughs> but I was like, <laughs> mm, <laughs> maybe. <laughs> <laughs> My Lord Balloon Store is like, like we don't we don't do those. Yeah, they do letters. Yeah. They letters and numbers. You can just oh, get them. Right, 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 right. Real right, big, right, right, right. just like chilling behind us. But I was like, that might That's be in crazy. bad taste. It's so crazy. Yeah. Thanks, <laughs> thanks for being so supportive of the Kickstarter oh, and stuff you too. You're so I, sweet. I had a really embarrassing moment with Danny when I was like so excited for you guys. I was talking to her about it and I was like tearing up. It's really cool. Uh, I'm gonna do it right now. Let's not talk about no, it. No, 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 <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's incredible. It's really um, cool. Well, thank you all so much for joining us on tonight's episode of Pub Draw. Pub Draw! <laughs> Thanks for... There we go! My heart! <laughs> I love it. Thank you for hanging out with us, Travis. Thank you for hanging thank out with you us. So much. Thank you taking guys, the time. Amazing. Hopefully you learned something about drawing. If you did draw something today and you won a chance to win a Cintiq 16, which is what I was drawing on, submit your drawings to pubdraw at critroll.com. Do us and Danny a favor. Do not submit to the email unless you are in one of the qualifying yeah. residencies. But feel free to share your work with us Yeah, on we want to see no matter where you live. We do want to see them. It's very important for us to like share that with you. Um, so yeah, share that on Twitter with the hashtag PubDraw. Let's see your grogs. And we will announce the winner of next week's, or this competition, next week at the beginning <laughs> of the episode. <laughs> <laughs> your prompter reading so rough this Fine. week, Marisha. I, everything. Why are you, why are you throwing things The third electronic again? that I've thrown. Why are you raging? <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's because of grog. It came through the screen. I'm telling you. Okay. I've lost uh, it all. Yeah, makes sense. <sighs> Let it go. In my head. Let, Let it go. go. <laughs> Maybe not like that. We love you all. Thank you, guys. We will see you next week. Bye. Bye. Good day. Good day. Good day. Thank you for watching this episode of Pub Draw. Pub Draw. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and catch the episodes live on Wednesdays at 5 p.m. Thank See you, guys. There.